One of the most important things that I've always wanted for Jalen to be as independent as possible, and with that comes work. I sat home and I was thinking, I don't want Jalen to be a young man living at home with his mother, watching television all day, and not seeing the world. If anything, it would cause him to regress. He needed some place that would really help build up his confidence and make him realize that, or help him realize. I was a sophomore in high school when I went started going to Glickman Academy. I, I was very interested in it. I, I like helping out. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel good to give back. I uh, met with the people from Spurwink and they came in and suggested this would be a great place for a job site. Someone in the school district in Wolfboro had visited Spurwink and thought that it would be a good place for him. I had a couple of job, on-site job trainings at Spurwink and I had a lot of fun and I learned a lot of great stuff. He really was done with his high school credits and needed to sort of take the next step towards independence, uh, which for him would meant getting a job. Some students come in and they have a real attention to detail or they really um, like to do a particular task. Uh, on a personal level, I like the fact that we can actually support the student coming in to do this. Um, I think it's one of those things that as a young adult um, could really help to make a difference. Well, he had a lot of practice in what it takes uh, to get a job, how to dress and how to go to an interview, how to write your resume. I actually really enjoyed it and I mean, it meant a lot to me. Like I learned a lot of great things. I mean, it just, it's amazing. It, they, they get to know people, they talk to people, they, you know, it's, it's, it's really fun. It becomes part of the community to step up and talk to people. We make them deliver the food, make them talk and how to, how to give the different manners, how to be nice, and how to be con congealed to uh, different customers. Great life skills. I mean, you know, I, I didn't even know how to crack an egg before I got here. And look at me now, I can crack with a, one hand, you know, and it's just great skills for when I move on and move forward with my life for cooking. I enjoy cooking for people now. It's a great hobby of mine. I actually go home and cook for my mom. Other businesses are even interested. I'd say at least give it a try. It, it's well worth it in the end. You first learn great, great um, partnerships with people. Any business owner that has an opportunity to try this type of a, an arrangement, if, if they have a position that, that's at the skill level that these kids can bring, it's definitely a win-win situation. It's a win for the student, um, it's a win for the business, it's a win for the community. Um, I think everyone benefits from it. And um, he's starting to work. And he started gradually in school, in Vogue. And I was so excited when he told me. I said, so Jalen, what do you do? And he, he told me about his first coffee cart job. And then I kind of would try to imagine it, but I didn't actually see it. And he told me he loves it. I had a feeling he would, and I haven't been there, and I take it. I probably don't need to be there because I'm his mother, and I want to be everywhere and see what he does, but I can just picture him working inside a building. I think Roy was much more confident when he came home than before he went there. Um, he's very comfortable uh, walking around town by himself. He's really making a life for himself. It's really, um, really made my confidence be a lot better. When I first uh, had my first job, like I said, I was um, kind of freaked out and didn't know what to do and was, didn't even want to leave the school, to be honest, to go to work. Um, but now I get up every morning and I just leave and go to work and it's, it's really helped me. I love that my son loves me and I love him, but the less that he feels he needs me, the better. And those are the days where you sleep back and say, wow, He's got his own thing, he's got his own life. Always have your own thing going on. Always, always.